In all pages, the subject of female beauty always generates mixed opinions, praise, voices for and against. And the island territory does not escape from these controversial positions. From the moment the candidates were announced, this time for the Miss Universe Colombia Cantes, the network exploded with all kinds of comments about all experience, Jose Dimineli Escalona Ben and Valeria Ajasrosa, two enchanting women with the attributes that highlight Caribbean beauty. Jose Di is an island woman born and raised in San Andres who aspired to represent the archipelago in this competition. This young woman is currently studying law at the University of Medellin. Jose is a woman who at 25 years of age stand out due to her well-farmed figure, her height of 1 meter 80, and her passion for reading. It is important to point out that she has the support of a large number of followers among the rice population as a candidate at this contest. This young native is considered in her community by many as a worthy representative of the rice woman, taking into account her origin is 100% Valeria Ajos, on the other hand, is a woman born in the city of Cartagena, but who has grown up in San Andres and who declares with conviction that she loves the archipelago as her homeland. In her statement, she assured that she identifies with the custom and tradition that invade the island territory. Valeria is a young woman of 26 years of age who stands out in her academic formation with studies and international relations. Ayos Bosa has been criticized for wanting to represent the archipelago, so my landers are sure that is an offense for the rice and female population to represent by someone who does not represent them, who has not have a future of physical attributes of a rice and woman aspect that are added to the fact that Valeria does not speak the native language which is Creole. So it is clear that these two young women are under pressure. So far neither of them has made any statement about the different facts, but it is clear that neither Valeria nor Josedi have given up their dream of being Miss San Andres or Providence and Santa Catalina in this contest and the community is looking forward to what will happen. From September 26 in Bogota until October 10 in Barranquilla, this casting will be placed where the president of the organization, in addition to a group of professionals, will be traveling around the city, just meeting the group of applicants from which they will select the final candidate for each department.